Welcome back to a new episode of TBH. I'm your host, Jay Specialist from TheBeerHeads.com. Let's get into today's episode. On today's episode, we're going to be reviewing a beer from Milton, Delaware, from the Dogfish Head Craft Brewery. Now, this beer is a collaboration beer they did with Dan the Automator from the underground hip-hop group Daltron 3030. Now, Daltron 3030 has to be one of the underground groups that I really, really like, so when I first heard they were coming back out with this, uh, I had to pick it up because I never got to try it the first time. This collaboration beer is part of their music series and they're calling it Positive Contact, a 9% ABV hybrid beer. This is going to be an ale with a cider blended into it. They're using Fiji apples to brew a cider, they're using roasted frog, they're using cayenne, and they're using fresh cilantro in this beer. Let's get this into a glass and I'll let you know what I think of Dogfish Head's collaboration with Dan the Automator of Daltron 3030 and Positive Contact. The appearance on the Dogfish Head Positive Contact, you're getting around a one finger to two finger, real fluffy, moshy white head. Um, definitely a great amount of alcohol leggings sticking to the glass on this one. You're getting a medium to a, a light medium gold, uh, subtle haze to this one, but still a nice filtered quality to it. But definitely some nice carbonation as well. All right, the nose on the Positive Contact. Yeah, you're definitely getting that nice, just ripe apple in here. But then you're getting also some nice, juicy orange, a little bit of a, a nice orange peel quality to it. Nice perfumey floral notes. Definitely getting a little bit of a coriander spice. And you can definitely pick up minimal, but just subtle amounts of that Cheyenne as well in this one. Cheers. Definitely an ale and definitely a, a, a cider mixed together for sure. Hybrid style. Definitely well balanced though. Up front, you get a lot of that just like nice moderate wheat quality taste to it. Um, you definitely pick up some of that cider up, so ripe apples. In the middle of the palate, you get a little chewy breadiness. Um, then you get some orange peel, some coriander on the sides of the palate. Back of the palate, you get a little dryness. You're getting some of that cayenne peppery, nice little finish to it with a little dryness, little alcohol booziness. Um, but it's very balanced. It doesn't really overpower the palate. Um, but you can definitely get that on the back palate. Mouth on this one, you're definitely getting a little tartness as well. Um, nice little carbonation bite on the palate, not too big, just a very subtle carbonation mouthfeel. Um, you're getting a, a medium light to medium body on this one. Alright, the final verdict on positive contact from Dan the Automator, Daltron 3030, and Dogfish Head collaboration beer. This is a pretty interesting beer. Um, for what it is, it's two beers in one. One's not overpowering the other, it's nicely balanced, and it's a good thing, and I think that's a well good hybrid when you have a hybrid that's balanced and you don't get one that overpowers the other and you can pick up both characteristics from each uh, style of beer and cider I think you do a good thing by doing that you don't overpower one and I think that's what makes this beer a little bit better and having me graded just a bit better than it should be um, I was gonna give this a 17 out of a 20 making this a B plus beer but just the fact that it's so balanced and you get both styles in this and it's not overpowering it you get similarities of a Belgian style whip beer and then you get that cider like quality to it so I'm gonna be giving this one an 18 out of a 20 making this an A minus beer I think this is pretty interesting it should have been a B plus but since it's you know it's not to what I think is a good
good beer, um, but it is a nicely balanced beer, and it has both takes of what they're brewing, a cider and an ale with. It's a fantastic one to check out. It's pretty interesting. And Dan the Automator from Daltron 3030, hands down, is one of the best producers. And Daltron 3030 is one of the best underground groups, period, in my opinion. One of my favorites to date, because of Dal the funky homo sapien from Hieroglyphics out of Oakland, California, from the Bay Area. And I'm from the Bay, San Jose, California. So it's a nice little bottle pickup for me to get because it's an interesting beer and it's one of my favorite groups hands down but other than that you guys check this one out i really insist you guys try it it's an interesting beer um it's nice to share and you're definitely going to get a semi-complex beer other than that like i always say live learn and drink i'm gonna enjoy my beer you guys should do the same